There lived an old black snake on the banks of a river where there were a lot of frogs playing happily. Since the snake was looking tired and sad, a small frog went near him and asked, What? Why are you so sad? By this time you would have at least had five to ten frogs to eat. Why are you so silent today? Are you not feeling well? Oh, nothing like that. I've been cursed. That's why I'm like this. What? Curse? Tell me in detail. Yes, I am. Two days ago, I chased a frog and it ended up sitting in the middle of a few scenes. I was waiting for it for such a long time, but it didn't come back. I got so angry and bit the saint's child and the child died. Immediately the saint cursed me. What curse? The saint said that hereafter, instead of eating these frogs, I'll have to carry them on my back and I must only eat the food that they give me, said the snake. Oh, is it? I'll immediately go and tell this to the frog king. He'll feel happy if he hears this. Yes, yes. Go soon and tell him and bring two frogs. Today I didn't carry any of them on my back. The frog also eagerly dived into the pond. Oh God, it's really tough in this old age to go in search of prey. Only way to survive is to cheat these small frogs and eat them. Earlier, these small kids used to shiver even to stand in front of me. And now he's coming and asking me questions. It's all my fate. Meanwhile, the small frog told the frog king about the snake's curse and jumped with joy. Immediately, the small ones fought as to who will play on the snake's back. They played on his back for some time. The snake also tempted the frog by moving his body slowly and bending it. This continued the next day also. After some time, he posed as if he was tired and puffing and panting. The frog king pitied him and allowed him to eat the smaller frogs. As days passed by, the snake had regained its strength and started to show its true color. Slowly he carried frogs on his back and went to some hideouts and ate them all. Since the small frogs didn't return home, the frog king inquired the snake, but the snake pounced on it and swallowed him also. Moral, do not believe anybody easily. You must see if the person is worth believing.